Each lung is made up of a huge network of tiny air passages. And the secret of what the lungs are for lies in the tiny air sacs at the end of each minute tube. The air sacs are called alveoli. But what are they for? Just looking at them gives you a clue they're surrounded by a network of blood vessels. That's why we breathe, to get oxygen from the air into our blood. Let's move inside an alveolus and take a close look at a single air sac and a single blood vessel. The air we breathe in is only 20% oxygen. The rest, nitrogen and other gases, is not much use to us, so we'll forget it. When we breathe in, there's more oxygen in the alveolus than in the blood vessel, so what happens next? It's called diffusion. Gases always move from areas of high concentration to low concentration. Oxygen molecules dissolve across the thin membrane of the alveolus into the blood vessels. This oxygenated blood returns to the heart and is pumped around the body to the tissues that need it. When you burn any fuel with oxygen, you get waste products. Blood arriving in the lungs has a lot of carbon dioxide in it, but the air inside the alveoli has hardly any. High concentration, low concentration. Carbon dioxide moves in the opposite direction from the blood to the air inside the alveoli. Breathing out removes the carbon dioxide and the whole cycle can repeat.